Hello, it's me, One Jam Games here, and I am playing Jurassic World Evolution 2. I was gonna say Chaos Theory, but we're not playing Chaos Theory anymore. We're playing Challenge Mode. So, 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 so. Right now, what I'm doing is getting more staffs. Okay, staffs. Okay, and I've done Expedition to get Carnival. Carno. And what I didn't show you last episode, right as it ended. I got like this unlocked. I didn't choose to, it just did it in its own. I got, I think it's because I made the Kano. It unlocked these two and this one here. And unlocked the birds. And everything got unlocked a little more, you know? So if I get more stuff, I could blaze through the research. Like I could spend the day just doing research as I gain passive money. Because I think that would be the best thing to do. I'll do it off screen because you guys don't want to see me wait around doing nothing so now that i've done that i can add more more stuff to my team oh my god guys i forgot to pause it after i trained the people um so carno has been researched till 50 percent or more so i can incubate him so i'm gonna put the um what do you call these guys the dilophosaurs in here hey welcome back guys so i earned enough money to create them I believe there's only two, but for now that's more than enough, you know. So now we have two carnal carnals, not carnivores, carnals. Okay. And once they've been added in, it should bring my appeal up, and more guests will come. More guests, more money, more money, better rating on stars. I work with the dinosaurs, and now you do too. I'm Owen Green. From my experience, I've learned the most important thing is to respect these animals. Because if you don't, they won't have any trouble making you their next meal. Nice. Okay. Nice. A Carnotaurus. You can recognize this predator immediately by the horns on its head, which give it a real rock and roll appearance. Those powerful legs can get this dinosaur moving as well, so probably best to stay out of its way. This dinosaur is so metal. Perfect. We learn from our failures, but here in the park, they can be expensive and deadly. That's why it's critically important you continue to excel. Lives depend on it. I will place the pathways later. For now, I will let these guys rest. Do the dinosaur, and then I will call it a episode. I could always increase the size, you know. Okay, I had to do it sooner or later. I might as well just didn't then. Okay. Okay, let me see. Let me add power generator right here. Oh, that's what I need to do. That was it. Power, 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 power. That's all that matters right now. What size do you need? Four or three? Three. Let's go. Set them up and knock them down. That's the way you take on these objectives. I feel like my excellence is rubbing off on you. Or maybe that's my cologne, huh? <laughs> okay, big man. Nice, okay, I got it. So whenever I make a lot of money, I could do that. I chose the ones with long lifespan, so I don't need to replace them anytime soon, you know? If I need to do anything right now, I can't. I took a gamble. So yeah, hope you guys did enjoy. Let me know what you guys think. After I add these guys, I'm going to end the episode there. Um, Let's see, what would they want? I can probably check if I go here. Uh, Water, open space, and meat. Wait, not prey? No, meat. They want meat. That's nice. It shouldn't take money for me destroying those. It should give me money because I can sell them in it. Right? Heading to collect the asset. I keep unlocking things. It's overwhelming, you know? Okay. Nice. Ooh, wait. If you want more, that's what I've got. More challenges in the form of a new objective. You'd think dinosaurs would be enough, but we have competition. Look, it's a raptor eat raptor world now, so we need to do everything we can to get our park rating on an upward trajectory. That's a measure of our success in Paleo Entertainment. Delivery complete. Hi. 
I'm Claire Deering. I'm extremely... Okay, she'll talk, and I do this. Uh, where is it, 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 where is my... Yep. Extremely passionate about the dinosaurs, and about our responsibility to take care of them. Transit has commenced. This dinosaur is important for a number of reasons. I mean, they're all important, but this one... The Deinonychus was the center of debate among paleontologists for many years. You keep talking. Specifically, were the dinosaurs cold-blooded or warm-blooded animals? With them alive and in the park, we have our answer. Success has a feeling all of its own, and you should be feeling it right about now. Nice. So yeah, I'm going to end the episode here now. Thank you all for watching. Appreciate the love and support. We made the Carno this episode. Carnotaurus, sorry. And this dinosaur that she said the name of that I can't pronounce again. Because I forgot how she said it. The Dinocococos. But yeah. Like always, share with your friends, like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you guys, okay, on the next one. Peace. Town to town